<laughs> so earlier this morning, uh, we checked out a new weeder, and now we're checking another high-tech gadget. That's right. We're going to check back with your produce man, Michael Marks, with the future. The Hello, future. Michael. Yes, cue the Jetsons music, that's for sure. Uh, so we're at the Yolo Fairgrounds for FIRA uh, 2024. Uh, this is our third time in California. They're bringing the best of robotics and uh, what they call AI. I'm calling it agricultural intelligence. That's AI, and that's what we're talking about here. Uh, this is uh, Bonsai Robotics right here in Davis. They're right here uh, in Davis. And uh, what you're seeing right down there is uh, it's coming our way, I promise. It's called an AR500. Uh, it is a, an autonomous uh, pulling uh, blast sprayer. And so this is real world uh, because this is a real orchard uh, that we've got here, not just at the Yellow Fairgrounds. Uh, and this is Tyler Nide. Tyler, how in the world did you come up with this? <laughs> Well, I've spent my whole career in agriculture and solving the problems of the grower has always been a big thing. In California specifically, there's a huge labor crisis and bringing the precision ag revolution to orchards and specialty crops has always been my goal. Precision ag is what you call it. I love that. Uh, what's your background? So my background, I've been in agriculture my whole career, started designing machines and then joined this really awesome company, Blue River, that was bought by John Deere and got to build out the autonomy stack at John Deere. And I've always wanted to bring the same technology to the orchard space, so. That's very cool. Mechatronics and robotics integration. What, that's a big phrase there. What does that mean? Completely, right? Robotics is really where hardware meets software. It's the intersection of the two. And with the new technologies with vision-based approaches, it really enables machines to operate at superhuman performance, better than humans. That is very cool. And you're the uh, one of the co-founders of Bonsai, right? right. Uh, let's talk to Brian Baum, uh, Baumgartner. You have, uh, let's come over here so they can see that in the background. Really? That's very cool. It's, it's coming our way. AR500 is coming our way. AR stands for? Uh, AR stands Air Ride. <laughs> I got that. Okay. Uh, so, Brian, you have an interesting background. You've been with SpaceX. Uh, you've done robotics under the ocean. How did you get started with all this? Yeah, you know, in college I studied physics and just really was excited about robotics and swarm robotics. And I've basically done robotics in air, land, sea, and space at this point. So anywhere you can put a robot, uh, it's been somewhere I've been interested in. And found my way to agriculture. I've been working with Tyler for over a year now, and it's been a lot of fun. Well, agriculture is lucky to have you. L look at that thing coming towards us. Uh, this uses vision based technology to see what's it how, how to use this vision based technology yeah so pretty much in the short it uses cameras in the same way that a human would use eyes so it's using cameras to do color context what's going on you know classification of what the objects are and then it's just looking around the scene and understanding where the trees are where the row is where the crop is and doing what it needs to do from there Look at that. So you're saving labor and it's efficient putting that spray. It's spraying. Uh, what kind of trees are these, by the way? These are almond trees. They're about midlife almond trees. Midlife almond trees. So here it comes. Here comes AR500. Is this autonomous? Yes, this is an autonomy. There's no one in the cab. Um, this is a fully autonomous machine. We do make a number of products that are everything from driver assisted technology all the way up to fully autonomous. Does it see us? Uh, it does see us. Uh, it will so stop. Will it stop? If it gets close enough, it will stop. So uh, no, no need to worry about that. All right, agriculture uh, intelligence here. Here comes AR500. I hope it stops. So much going on with agriculture and robotics. It's the coolest thing on the face of the planet. You can tell I'm a little bit giddy. Hey, uh, there's so, so much more coming with uh, Good Day Sacramento. So stay right here with us.